What's up, guys? All right, we're going to take a look at uh, the app Harley's Cure to uh, fix Terrarium TV. Um, try to make this video pretty quick. So, as of right now, Terrarium TV is not working, won't open up. Um, what it's doing is basically visiting an internet site and it doesn't allow it to open. So, well, first thing we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and launch inside of Cody. And we're going to let Cody load up for just a minute to do all its processes in the background. See, it's doing its updating and processes at the top. We'll wait for the uh, little notification or message board to pop up, and then we should be good to go. Um, we're gonna we're gonna access the uh, Android app installer. Uh, you can access it in two different places. One will be directly under Android apps, all the way to the right. Um, two in the star in the lower left hand corner. Of the screen that's your favorites menu so I'm going to go here under uh, the Android app installer Let's see if it'll open up now all right and I put it right here just the the first the first app right there so we're just going to install it Yes, we do need to download it. Real small. Uh, go ahead and go to install at the bottom. And uh, from here, uh, you can just open it. And then it is, it's all configured. So all we have to do is go to the bottom down here. And it's kind of hard to see, you can't really see the highlight, but just click the start. Go ahead and give it permission to uh, set up a VPN connection. And then you can see up here where it says active in the upper left-hand corner area. Uh, that means we're good to go. So we're going to get out of the app. And then I'm just going to hit the home button, go to uh, the Amazon page. And we'll go ahead and try to open Terrarium. It's open, so Terrarium will work the same way as I always had. Um, let's take a look at a couple things. So Harley's Cure will run in the background. Um, unfortunately, at this point, that's what we're doing to correct it. Um, so we can always access it by going to the Applications menu. Manage Installed Applications. Harley's Cure, and we'll launch application. I'm just going to kind of show you the nuts and bolts of it a little bit. So um, it is set up that even, even if you power down the device, once you power it back up, it'll automatically start. Um, what it actually does is look at the host. All right, this line right here, this is the... Uh, website that Terrarium looks for to uh, to deactivate basically is what it is doing. Um, so it's just been set up you know, to go there and, 
that actually blocked the fire stick from going to that website. So uh, all the rest of that stuff down there is just thinking I'm funny. Um, really, the nuts and bolts of it, I guess you really don't know too, too much about. Um, I will say if you, if you get to a point where Terrarium TV is not working and it just shuts out, um, you can always come in here. Like for some reason up there, it uh, says stop. I think I hit force close when I was in that area. So if Terrarium's not working, just make sure that this says active in here and uh, you should be good to go. So I think that's about it. Uh, not much to it. Uh, it took longer to put together than it uh, did anything. But uh, hopefully this should work well for you. Um, if you guys have any questions, you know how to get me. Thanks for taking some time. Uh, Terrarium TV, at this point, still working the same way it always did. Uh, I will say that with this correction, um, Real Debrid will still work and Track still works. So however you were using it before, Everything should work exactly the same. Um, I'll keep up on any changes to it, and I'm going to keep looking for new apps that work as well, if not better, um, because Terrarium TV is no longer being serviced, but in my opinion, it's still one of the best out there. Y'all have a great week.